this is a game you guys more or less had to win just to kind of stay in that playoff hunt. Uh, you guys kind of hung in it f through 40 minutes and had a real nice push in the third and got it done in the shootout. I mean, what can you say just about the, the effort, you know, just based on what was on the lines, man? Yeah, it was a good effort. Um, I mean, every night's a must win for us right now, you know, and, and we've known that for a while and uh, we've let some slip away. You know, we weren't, we weren't happy about last night. I think that was pretty clear and uh, we wanted better tonight and I think in a lot of ways it was better uh, we got ourselves in some trouble with penalties and you know it was definitely not our a full 60 minutes we had stuff we, you know would have liked to uh, had a little more complete effort but it was a good win and we needed it and we needed like you said just to uh, kind of keep ourselves alive Brett Kulak made his pro debut tonight uh, a few years ago that you may have made your pro debut. I mean, how, how, you know, do, do, do you remember that? And I guess, uh, how did you feel about, uh, you know, a guy like Brett getting his shot uh, there tonight? It was great. It was great. He, uh, he, did, he did great. I said to him, it looks like he's played a lot of these so far. He, was, uh, he did great. All our young D-men are, are, are really stepping up and, and taking big minutes for us at a time when we need them to, you know. And uh, it's not easy to do, especially... Especially for Kulak and, and Sykes there, um, you know, they've played with other teams for a full season. You kind of get your habits and your routines because of those systems. So it's not easy to come in and, and learn a new system and hop right into a lineup. And, and they've both done done great with it. I was uh, really impressed with Cooley tonight. You were the only veteran D-man with five rookies on the blue line. Did you feel you have to step up in any way tonight? No, we're, uh, we've become a, a close group back there fairly fast, um, and it's been great. It's because they're all great guys, and, uh, and we all get along great. And, yeah, we lost Karst this week, and we've, uh, you know, there's been some moving parts. But, um, no, you know, a lot of talk on the bench. But, um, you know, they're all great players, and they're here for a reason. So I don't have to do too much different, you know. Um, like I said, just we all communicate really well, and, and our coaches, you know, do their part and, and get them ready, and, and they've done a great job at that. So... So no, as long as they, they play like they did tonight, we're, uh, we're a good group back there. Did you do anything different defensively to sort of slow down Grand Rapids today? Uh, I noticed that they really only got any scoring chances off giveaways. They didn't create much themselves. What did you do different? Um, you know, we made some, some changes from last night for sure, and uh, you know, even some in-game changes. Um, but they're just a, they're a skilled team that you can't give too much space to, and, and we learned that the hard way last night. Um, so we need to, you know, take away that time and space. And I thought we did it better tonight for the most part. Um, you know, not, not not letting them get that space, especially when they're in their zone and in the neutral zone, they get, this, you know, speed coming at you. They're a tough team to stop. So, um, you know, it's not just in our D zone, but it's it's the full ice. Our four check got in there a little better for the most part tonight, and uh, it slows them down. In a shootout, are you glad to have guys like Chris and uh, Blair, or do you wish that Ward would tap you on the shoulder and let you <laughs> uh, I think I'd I think I'd tap them on the shoulder before I would too. Um, you know, guys like that that's that's their uh, that's their thing and they're good at it, you know. Um, you know, we all have our, what we try and contribute to a team and, and you know, um, those guys are good at it. Chris has been great at it all year and Jonesy's been great since he's been down here and uh, it was really nice to get a shootout win because, you know, early in the year we, we lost a lot of those. So it was good for our for our team in there, and uh, you know we get a long week ahead of us to get ready for for Toronto and, and get two more. Last question. 